Hey champions, today's question of interest is what if we never sheared sheep? For those of you who are wondering what shearing means, let me brief you quickly. Now shearing actually it's the first step in the process of obtaining wool. What happens in this? There is removal of fleece. Fleece is the hair, right? Along with thin layer of skin. For all the animal lovers out there, don't worry, this is not going to hurt the sheep. Now I know what's popping in your head. If we'll actually stop shearing, this is going to affect the woolen industry. The production might go down or, or it might end. You are absolutely on the right track, but there is much more to it. So let's dive in and figure out. And let's start this journey by examining the impact on humans. Now we have such a happy equation with sheep, isn't it? We have co-evolved with sheep and vice versa is also true. We depend on sheep for clothing, for food and of course for income. And in turn, what do we provide? Well, we provide protection from predators, we provide consistent feed and we also provide health care. So there is mutual need for care and support that's there, right? And this has been there since 10,000 years. Now this friendship that we are talking about was born as a survival strategy to survive wet and cold weather when vegetable fibers and animal skins proved to be useless. Now, vegetable fibers didn't provide warmth and animal skins, they were not soft or insulating. So, what did we go for? We opted for the soft, comforting wool that, that was warming as well, right? From sheep. Also, along with our evolving relationship with sheep, we also developed multiple breeds of sheep all over the world. Now, it's time to see what's the impact of all this on the animal itself. So, shearing is actually really, really crucial, not just to the industries, but also to the animal itself. That means we are talking with respect to sheep. Why is this? This is because it is going to affect the health of sheep. So, shearing is crucial for the sound health of sheep because those sheep that skip shearing are at the risk of First of all, overheating. Now, we cannot wear woolen clothes in summers, right? The same goes for sheep also. When the temperature is high, it's going to affect them. Why? Because this fur is actually very warm, it's very heavy and therefore, it's not suitable for them during summers. It's going to be very difficult for them to survive during summers. Now, the next important point is discomfort. So, heavy wool is also going to affect their movement. So, they will have trouble walking or running and this is going to affect their day-to-day -day activities. For example, this is going to affect grazing and they'll also find it difficult to protect themselves from the predators. Next important point is disease. Well, this is a very important point. So, this dense wool actually becomes a hot spot for parasites as you can see over here and it can lead to many diseases. And also, there is one more danger that is wool blindness. Now, look at this. And over here, you will actually notice that the wool has grown so much that it's impairing the animal's sight. Now, this sheep is unable to see. Unfortunately, it's definitely unable to see and now it's at the mercy of its predators. Moving on, let's see how not shearing is going to impact the environment. Now, sheep actually contribute to the environment by grazing. I know it sounds a bit absurd, right? You might be thinking this is out of place. How is this true? But grazing has its own benefits. Let's see what they are. So grazing basically can help to strengthen the soil. It can also help to mitigate climate change and of course reduce forest fire. Now how all this is related to, you know, environment and grazing and shearing. So when we talk about shearing, we just talked about that if not if shearing is not being done what's going to happen it's going to impact sheep's movement if the sheep's movement is being impacted no grazing could be done if grazing is not being done obviously the benefits of grazing that we have won't be there and it's definitely going to impact the environment and this is how the environment would be affected if shearing is not being done. So I think it's safe to say that shearing is curing it's good for the sheep it's good for the humans like for us and of course it's good for the environment as well. But hey, there is one good outcome to our question. 
Right. So there is a silver lining, and what is this? Well, let's see. If we never shear sheep, workers of the wool and industry would be safe from anthrax. So this deadly bacteria actually causes fatal blood diseases for the workers, you know, who are working in the wool and industry. But that's the only good part. Rest everything. We can definitely say no good is coming out of it. So. we can definitely conclude that shearing is really really important and now you know what will happen if we never sheared sheep all right so if you found this video interesting quickly hit the like share and subscribe button and hey don't forget to click on the bell icon as well take care bye bye